At time when all eyes are set on the carbon cost of transport, logistics must not only be efficient, it must also have the lowest environmental impact possible. So we're considering the targets um, for this project, as in many other projects, we have to do a good balance act between cost to make our business sustainable and profitable, customer service that we deliver on time, and last but not least, of course, emissions and greenhouse gas targets that we have. Early designed logistics plan has indeed many advantages to offer, including the one that is the most important for our project, reducing CO2 emissions. The decisions that we make in how to transport can have a drastic impact. For example, choosing air cargo versus rail is 3% the CO2 impact or less than what you would have using air cargo. So the differences in the decisions that we make from the sourcing of the material and the urgency to bring those materials, it will have a considerable impact at the, at the bottom line. So what we did is we uh, chose a different manufacturer of steel in a different place to reduce uh, the, particularly the environmental impact of the transportation of the iron ore from Australia to a more a closer place in Europe uh, in order to uh, cut the environmental impact of the iron ore logistics. Smart Logistics is a solution that we used in this case from Dassault Systems and this combines a different set of capabilities that were necessary for this project. From enabling the collaborations between not just different stakeholders and different businesses and companies, but within the company itself that many, many times they operate in silos. And then enabling all the different options and possibilities that only using advanced optimization capabilities like the ones we have will allow us to make much better decisions according to the KPIs that are important for this project. The experts are moving in the right direction towards a more sustainable tower. But we still had to plan another key step. It's daily energy and resource consumption.